hey what's up guys this is Kaushik and in today's video I am going to discuss about the Ubuntu software so I don't know if you have ever faced any problem with this but for me the experience has been really really bad some of the times I when I try to install something say for example this AMD toolkit click on install nothing happens it simply doesn't install it and I'm trying it for last two days so it is really really painful sometimes the third party uh, applications also does not tend to get installed using this you want to software so I was not happy with this and I was looking for any other way to actually install packages in Ubuntu without using the software center or the Ubuntu software right then I came across this which is called G Debye and this is a package installer which lets you install local dev packages so mostly if you want to install say google chrome or any other version uh, the providers generally uh, give you a .deb file and uh, most of the times if you don't have this package installer installed in ubuntu it will open in ubuntu software and then you have that install button which may or may not work for you so at that point of time I decided okay I need a separate package installer and I landed up on this GDB package installer so how to install this right and you was you will at this point of time may be thinking okay so you are telling me how to avoid Ubuntu Center but the software you are showing me is actually I, I need to use software center to install the software in the first place and isn't that irony well that is so if you don't want to use that you can simply go here and run this command which says sudo apt-get install gdb and this does the exact same thing you don't have to even open the software center or you want to center so once this gdb is installed right how you can use it okay let's go to downloads and say i have got this uh, particular theme file which is of .deb uh, type right so i can just right click on that and say open with other application and there you go it says recommended applications it says gdb package installer software install and archive manager so you just have to select this and then select once you do that it basically opens up in the package installer now since I already have this particular package installed it will say reinstall package or remove package if it was not installed you would have got a install package button here and once you click on that it probably would have asked you to enter your system password and it would have installed the software for you so it is very convenient very lightweight and very reliable so when you want it to work it works and that's the beauty of it so I'm pretty uh, much enjoying uh, the fact that I don't have to really use the Ubuntu software anymore and I can rely more on the GDB and it does the job for me so that's all for today that's all I wanted to show you today in case this video helped you don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also uh, stay subscribed to our channel because without your support uh, we cannot do really anything so that's all for today thank you for watching and you have a great day